So we're in the woods, northern Wisconsin, early September. My wife is a big time mushroom hunter and she found a bunch of puffers earlier. We're gonna get some more. It rained all day yesterday and about half a day today. So it's a good time to find them. So I'm just kind of following her. This is a mixed patch of forest. We've got aspen, white pine, elm, a lot of maple. And we'll come back when we find a patch. So I'm going to walk over, try not to step on any. Okay, found some more over here. They've got the little bumps or spines on them. Let's see that one. The that's a big one. Get to, oh, that's, these are babies. Okay. Big ones are like watermelons. No kidding. Oh, you showed me that picture of the lady holding a beach ball. Yeah. That was a mushroom. There's another one. Yeah, we are getting close to the river. These are so pungent, aromatic. I'm 10 feet away and I can smell it. It's like a sniffing a mushroom log. All right, we're back with the harvest and all she's doing now is tipping them, really taking the soil off. You said you didn't want to rinse them, you just want to get rid of the soil that way? I'm just knocking off the, the spores. Okay. And Will you chop these up and saute them? And typically, I think you would. She's all done. They look amazing. Time to saute them. And she picked some Thai basil, this perfect, this purple flower with basil. I could smell that 50 feet away. It's wonderful. And it came off of this beautiful plant. Everything out of the garden except the onions. And she's gonna put these in there, so we're gonna fire this up and see what happens. I'm excited. This can be a replacement, I'm told, for tofu, and you can actually see that just by looking at it. Coming together. Here it is, all said and done. It's like a vegetable medley with a mushroom aroma. Really fantastic, super healthy. We just added a little of Thai basil and soy sauce to make kind of a, a Asian fusion type uh, dish. But go out to the woods, find these puffer mushrooms, and enjoy. Thanks for watching.